This guy always gives 10% more. Bugs away. What a pro. Wix Trade Pro sponsors coverage of the World Darts Championship. One hundred and eight. Will you mind, G? This fella had to come through the first round of the World Championship. And cross responding in some style here. Ah. We've got quite a game on our hands here. He looks like he's up for it, Nigel. I suspected it. He's right into this mentally already. Good sign for him. No, I do. like what I'm seeing Robbie from uh, Dirk as well. This really could get even better. Sparks will be flying in this oh, one with the voltage one, in action. Serving us up an early treat. The early signs are promising for this match. Match three of four this evening. Yeah, down for the 19s. No, nice 96. use of cover from Van Dijven Boda. And now 56 for Rob Cross for a hold. Check the scoreboard, and there's a single 20. Needs double eight for a 2 1 lead. Yeah. Nice finishing. Good two out of four for him. We'll make it Dirk the throw first. Game. And you might ask why why is he not a seed? He's, he yeah, was in the final of a, a major, but he got his card at the beginning of this year. Two year system. Even that couldn't catch him up to be a seed. Yes, and that, that was the point I was Robbie making, that, you know, 90. Rob Cross looking at the first round draw and Van Dijvenberg are arguably the pick of the first round players that you'd like to avoid in an ideal world as a second round player. Double 18, break of throw now, Rob Cross. Big moment coming in, this is for the first set. A customary... Delay before the throw. Oh, nicely yeah. done. Yeah. The first set. Rob Cross off to a good tidy start here. He takes the first set. Oh. Down the board. What a visit that is from Van Dijvenboer. He leaves double eight. Goodness me, that was a tremendous visit. Seventy-eight. So this is for the set then. Double eighty needs from Dive and Bird. It's a level yeah, and a one set all. Set. Game on no. here at Alexander Palace. It's a World Championship second round and Van Dive and Boda is really up for this. Whoever wins this leg will only need one set to go through to the third round of the World Championship. Cross back up to 91.7 with his average now. Van Dijvenboer to 94.2. 161 needed for the set. Well, he's going to be back here anyway. He knew that before he even threw the first arc because Van Dijvenboer behind on 148. Cross is going to be back for 57 for the set to go two sets to one ahead. One away from the match. There's the single 17. Needs tops. Yeah, Good finish. Great set. finish, Rob Cross. Rob Cross. Now he's well, played well there. He's played well, well enough first. to get that set on the board. Game. But John, is it a fair comment to say this fella, Dirk van Dijvenboda, didn't help himself there? Well, he just seems hesitant for whatever reason well, a lot of times it, in the yeah. last couple of legs. When he approached that double eight, for instance. Well, the former world champion, Rob Cross. 100. Has the advantage here by two sets to one. One set more, and he'll be through to the third round against Adam Hunt, of course. Beaten one by Kim Hybrex last three. year, Rob Cross. It would be a significant result for him in the context of the year that he's had. If you could get through to the uh, the third round here, 
140. I'm sure there's a lot more, a lot more darts left in this game yet, John. Well, Dirk's producing a fantastic leg here. Down to 87 after nine darts, and with the throw, pretty much unbeatable. Only a nine would would do that. If you can take that 87 out. So it's a good way to bounce 49. back from some iffy darts in the third set. The fourth set looking much better. Double 18. Yeah, from the 11 dart right. leg. More it's like it from Dirk van Dijvenbroda. Got it together there beautifully. The thing about it is they're not hanging around either. Are they? It's good to watch. It's a easy on the eye from both players the slowest bit is when they hesitate for a double which is oh, the normal thing for Rob not so much 18. for dirt yeah. he stops double 10 but he's back eight. anyway yeah missed his 11th and 12th darts for double but as you say no big deal what happened there with Rob with Dirk looking at him. Is it 64. just a noise as he maybe moved his bottle or something? Anyway, double ten. Yeah. He's going two for double four. Sixteen. Well, this just got very interesting. Go on 109. He's just allowed himself to be distracted somehow, some way. Treble 19. No. So double two. 41. For Dirk Thank when he returns ball. here, Four. they'd be more than eager to wrap this up. Getting closer. Getting further away. No score. Yeah, that was a shocker of a second dart. Probably require 68. Rob probably can't believe his luck here. Well, it's, it's only going to mean he gets one leg and he's still down to one. But still, you're right. He can't believe his luck here. Well, it keeps the set alive. Yeah. yeah I mean, he's still kind of against the odds, but... 43. Four. Surely this time Dirk van Dijvenbode for two sets apiece. Double two needed. Up to the top and double one. That's a decent marker. Yeah. Yes, double it four. is. Dirk van, Dirk van Dijvenbode, two sets apiece now. First leg is rocked through. And we are into yeah. a decider. Oh, 134. Oh, no trouble. Against the throw, he's not really threatening Dirk, and he's got to break at some stage if he's going to win this match. Rob Cross knows. Oh, Two more holds of throw, and he's through. And he's not really being tested here. He's not. Doesn't even have to really look at the scoreboard at this stage with any great concern. It's it's all in his hands. Not. He, he is throwing a pretty good leg, though. After nine, he has won three seven. Uh, that's hard to catch up to a little. 57. Leaves 80. Now that Dirk needs a big, huge turn here. 180, the 140. He can still get. Yes, so he does leave a finish at least. Probably require 80. Now, big moment. Rob Cross. 80 needed. 20 for tops. To go within a leg of the match. Went high with that yeah, single 20, but my Rob goodness Cross. me, that's a fantastic finish. And Rob Cross is one leg away from the third round of the World Championship with that dart. Oh. Van Dijvenbode, no trouble, and a 180 for Rob Cross. Is he on the way? Edging towards the finish line. Van Dijvenbode in deep trouble here now. He hits the lot. He's not going out without a fight here. Dirk Van Dijvenbode. Can Cross get at it again? Two singles. 60. 60 scored. What a battle. Some real passion in this man showing. 
104. We remind you, Van Dijvenbode wins this leg, and we are going down to a sudden death one leg shootout to decide who goes through to round three. This fella will have the advantage of the throw. 43. But it's looking like sudden death. Yeah, it looked on his last start throw, and Rob Cross resigned to it. It's a bull. But does he go for it? Now he settles down. 92. Okay. He didn't get too carried away. As, as pumped up as he is, he didn't go for the bull. Right thing to do? Oh, I think so. But maybe not for him because he's he, he seems to hit when he gets Thank aggressive. 32. Okay, double 16 to take us to one leg. Another double eight needed. Right, OK, we are down to a sudden death leg to decide who goes through to round three. Game. What sort of start can Cross make? Needs a treble 20 in the first three darts. There's one of 140 doing beautifully. Well, 100. a 100 scored with the throw. Puts pressure now on this fella to try and hit a 140 or a 180, John. He certainly does, and... Oh, he's just got all that adrenaline ball. flowing, and he's using it well. It's not a hindrance, it's a help. This man, his adrenaline's pumping too, but his demeanor is oh, quiet and focused. Okay. But his heart's pumping. That was a good 140. It means this fella needs one as well. Chasing the game here now, Dirk, because of the fact that he threw second. Oh, and the travel 19 once again. Keeping him in this. Another treble 20 for Cross would do him nicely. Oh, I'll tell you what, he's playing well here, John. He's just doing what he has to do. Well, especially after a treble one on the wire, and he comes back and stays there with two more, uh, two treble 20s. Another treble 19. There you go. At it again. He's 99. What can Rob do here? Well, 84 now for this dart, so many options. Treble 16, treble 20. Treble 20, double 20. No. He stayed there. Stayed there, there yeah. That's odd. <laughs> Would have left double 15 had he hit it. Well, Van Dijvenboda is going to be back for the match. Oh, 126. Super last Take dart, which means 99. here now, this has got to go for Van Dijvenboda. 99 the score. Well, we've talked about this, Nigel, and this isn't the sort of strategy that seems to benefit him. Let's see what happens. First dart vital here. Treble 19, he's got it. 10. Six for double 18 here for the match. Oh, Van Dijvenboda! That is sensational! Oh, Rob Cross, the former world champion, has been put out. It's gone to sudden death, and what a match that was. And Dirk Van Dijvenboda's remarkable rise on the big stage continues with a place in the third round of the world championship where he will play Adam Hunt. What a match! Rob Cross is out of the World Championship. It's Dirk Van Dijvenboda who goes through. Sky Sports. Feel it all. This guy always gives 10% more. Mugs away. What a pro. Wix Trade Pro. Sponsors coverage of the World Darts Championship.